Hello, how are you guys doing? Uh, let me... Okay. Yeah, what's up boys? How y'all doing? Boys and girls? I am a good person. Hello, hello. Yeah, dude. Um, so, turns out I, I am able to stream today. I did wake up uh, pretty late though, unfortunately. Um, so I'm still gonna end my stream at 12. Uh, I still want to follow that, you know, schedule. Hey, Cody. Mm, sorry. Yeah, I woke up uh, late as shit. Um, I'm gonna eat a couple oranges before I play. Coming from my vaccine side effects. You just chilling? Like you feeling all right? Yeah. Um. Dude, I don't know why, but like lately, I've been having a fuck ton of nightmares and. It's so weird. Like, okay, so I, I, uh, I got a new bed like a month ago and it's amazing. Like fucking incredible bed, dude. Actually so good. I I've been using the same bed since I was, uh, I think since before I was fucking born pretty much the bed is so old. Um, so this new bed like changed everything. Like I can actually get like a good night's sleep on it, but, um, this has been going on for a while. The whole nightmare thing had been going on for like years, honestly. And, uh, it stopped for the first, I want to say two to three weeks that I had, uh, the new bed and it was nice. It was like, Oh my gosh, I can sleep without waking up in the middle of the night. Um, you know, freaking out to a fucking nightmare, but then it started happening again. And I don't know why. Um, so like last night I woke up at five in the morning because I had a nightmare that uh, everyone I know and cared about was like, this is going to sound so fucking ridiculous. Um, they were all like killed by a, like a, like some mass dude with a fucking minigun just like killed everybody. And then, <laughs> and then he pushed me out a win out the window and I fell and then like I snapped my neck and then I woke up and I was like, what the fuck? Like, why do I keep having like random dreams like this? I'm doing. Oh, okay, I read that. I got a bad fever. Did you take any medicine or just a vaccine? Hey, Pinoy Chat. Hope you're. Hey, how you doing, Asher? How you doing, King? Um, I had more and more nightmares as of late. Yeah, I don't know why. Probably stress. I did read that stress in induces nightmares. I'm like, I'm stressed, but I'm not like uh, overtly stressed or anything. I've been doing a lot better lately, to be honest with you. Pinoy Breath of the Wild. What? <laughs> Have you been wearing socks to bed? Nah, it's Florida, man. It is hot as fuck over here. Literally just like existing is burning here. What's up, Dweeb? How you doing, King? Yeah, dude, some Pusona. I covered a lot just drinking hot black tea and my pillow vitamin C. I'm jacking on using my fan or EC. Yeah, when I'm sick, I'll, I'll wear excessive clothing to like sweat like crazy, and it helps. Pretty normal for the different nightmares, but their reoccurring similar nightmares would be something deeper. Um, the nightmares I have are usually people I care about dying. It, it, they die in different ways, but it it always it's always them dying and then I die at the end. It's so weird. Like, I started Persona 2 IS yesterday for fun. Yeah, how do you how do you feel about it? Anyone else been playing the new AI Somnium Files game? I haven't I haven't played the first one yet. I own them, but you know, as usual, I haven't played them. You need to find a way to go Super Saiyan. <laughs> it's so true, honestly, so true. Dude, everyone I know is like a pro at eating cherries, but I can't fucking. I'm like shit at it, bro. Like I like cherries, but I'm shit at eating them.
What made you think it it feel dated? Because um, from what I know, it's made by the Zero Escape and Danganronpa team, like as a collab. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it is. That's fucking terrifying, Simpson. Jesus Christ. Oh, the Dongram is not evolved. Okay. The, this one nightmare that stuck out to me since I was a kid is like the best way I could explain it is literally PT. I'm not even kidding. Which is why PT like scared the fuck out of me. Um, she gave me PTSD. When I was a kid, uh, I was literally like six years old and I had a nightmare of, um, this red like demon ish figure and it was like moving in like uh like like the pt monster like how she moves it was moving like that and it was just like chasing me around like uh I, I like a house and every time i had the dream i would get scared and like run to my mom <laughs> Showtime! What's up, Walter? Thank you for 20 months, King. How you doing, man? I always have a nightmare where I drive a car and the brakes don't work. I've actually had that happen in real life. Um, funnily enough, one of my friends, um, who's like big into cars, he was driving me around and he was like, yo, check this shit out. I don't know anything about cars. So I don't know what he was doing, but he was doing something with like the fucking the thing that changes gears I don't know what it's called uh, he was doing something with that to like show off something to me and um, when he pressed down on the the pedal um, the the car like worked for a second um, but he couldn't brake because it wasn't working and then the car just like stopped working in the middle of the road I was like bruh am I gonna die <laughs> You don't need to, to share if you don't want to, bro. Uh, Ray. Driving is scary. I actually still don't have my license. <laughs> I, w I need to get it for like emergencies, but um, I'm not joking when I say I don't leave my house. Are you gonna get Persona 5 on PC when it comes out? Yeah. Talking about nightmares? Yeah. How you doing, Nepsy? Haven't seen you in a while, bro. Include me losing teeth. Interesting. I've never heard of anything like that. Is it just different ways? Like somebody like plucking your teeth out or your teeth falling out, etc. Stuff like that. Sorry, I'm like peeling an uh an orange right now. Been busy working, that's understandable. Yeah, lately has been like the most I've worked in a while, but um, I'm I'm happy about the work I'm doing currently. They're just falling up by themselves. That's so weird. Do you have like a fear of? Are you afraid if if somebody touches like your teeth or something? Like a dentist or something like that. Hat. A nightmare of being naked at school a lot. I had a nightmare in uh, elementary school that I wore my mom's underwear going to school. And everyone made fun of me for it. I think, um, nightmares are so random, to be honest with you. I'm fine with the dentist, but I'm not there very often. My teeth are pretty fucked, that's why. You know, I, I do have like a mild fear of like 
my teeth being fucked because I, I've said this story before. I never, I've never been to the dentist a single time because growing up, my uh, I was very poor and my dad um, was like against the idea of me getting dental. Um, now I should get it now because um, I can kind of afford it. Um, I, I should do it now. It's just like the thing that holds me back is I, I grew up with this mentality of like, okay, American healthcare is expensive as fuck. You could tough it out. But like, I don't have amazing teeth, you know? I don't. So uh, thankfully, I don't like a lot of sugar related items. So my teeth aren't horrid, but my teeth aren't that great. So. Uh, probably nightmare I always have growing up is falling from high place. Most people I knew had something like that. It's a common dream for people whose lives are changing uh, to have dreams, their teeth. What the heck? I wonder if that's where the tooth fairy thing came from. Yo, Don, thank you for the um, thank you for calling me handsome, bro. Uh, I don't know if I'm as handsome as you, but God bless you, dude. I've had I've had dreams like that. Also, I don't know, man. I feel like dreams are generally uncontrollable, so like kind of hard to call it cringe, you know. I did um I don't know if I can do it any Oh, you guys are going to laugh when I when I tell you this. Oh. Um, so um you guys know lucid dreaming? It's like the ability to control your dream. Now, I could never 100% lucid dream. Um, like, I, I couldn't be in the dream and know it was a dream. I could never get to that point. But I wanted to do it so bad because I wanted to, like, control what I'm, you know, what I'm dreaming, obviously. And the way that I did it would be I would, like, imagine a scenario uh, in my head and as long as that scenario is in my head I'll fall asleep and that scenario will become my dream excuse me so I've been doing that like since high school now nowadays I can't really do it because I just end up having a nightmare anyway but um you guys know how I always talk about how I want to um get good at fighting games you get <laughs> Uh, there was a long period of time where I would dream that I'm playing Guilty Gear Strive and like labbing. That was that I would literally like imagine me labbing in Guilty Gear. And then my dream would be me playing Guilty Gear. I'm not even kidding. I would do this for like so long. Eventually, I can't do it anymore. But um, I was doing this for like a long period of time. <laughs> Based. <laughs> That was that was literally my way of like, bro, it's like, um, what is it? Shadow boxing or, or mental training? That was literally what I was doing. Kanoi on Guilty Gear roster. You guys ever had a wet dream? I, I had a wet dream once. Um, I woke up and I had turbo nut everywhere. And um, at the time, I didn't have like a closet or like a thing to put my clothes in my my room. So I had to like run across the house to go to my mom's room because her room was the only one with a closet in it. Uh, and that's where my clothes were. So I had to like walk like like that across the house. My mom's like, uh, are you okay? I'm like, don't worry about it. And doesn't go and grab some fucking uh, clothes to change. One, one or two back when I'm a teenager. See, that's what freaked me out because I wasn't a teenager when, when I had a wet dream. I thought they didn't exist. And then I had one at, at like, Maybe like 21, 22 years old, something like that. Uh, I'm going to throw away these orange peels and bring back these cherries. Give me a sec. Be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Can't tell the difference in <laughs> some fat fucking nut. Um, last thing I wanted to tell you guys before I uh, play, I had an interview with, uh, uh, I guess a company. I believe the interview goes live today. I don't know what time, but whenever it's live, I'll probably post it in my discord if you want to uh, read it. Um, it's about like me being an editor and like the stuff that I work on and you know like content creation shit that I like my my videos my channel stuff like that it's like a bunch of things this man doing numbers yeah yeah wow world famous she prime time been the way over here oh my god I have Kazu and I'm fully boost my triple crown lease can hit for a total of 95k damage wow that's incredible dude Fortune 500. Hi, Zach. I'll hit you with a 10 hit combo. Okay, here, let me do my audio clip. Oh, uh, let me see. I did. I'll listen to it after the stream. Oh, I should mention. Um, if you are a patron, a Twitch sub, or a YouTube member, please check the message I posted in my Discord. Um, I... I want to like, I don't want to say it uh, for people who are like non, you know, uh, non patrons or, or, or like Twitch uh, subs, but essentially I'm making something and I want those people to help me out in the sense that I want you guys to be a part of it. Um, and it's going to involve you guys sending me like audio clips and I'm going to do something with it. What is like the scenario? I'm pretty sure I said the scenario in, uh, in the, in the post, but I can clarify it there later. But uh, here, let me swap scenes. Wait a sec, this might hurt your ears, chat. 